The Democratic National Convention kicked off in Chicago today, and South Dakota's delegates are looking forward to the week. Kelloland's Lauren Solok brings us their perspectives from the Windy City. More than 4,000 delegates are convening in Chicago this week to recognize Vice President Kamala Harris as the Democratic nominee for president. That includes delegates from South Dakota who are excited about what lies ahead. Being at the DNC is an incredible opportunity and an honor to be able to represent South Dakota in this capacity is um, not a light opportunity and the energy here is just so positive. It really shows that America is ready to move on from such divisive behavior that we've seen in the last few election cycles. We're so excited for the Harris Waltz ticket. You know, uh, Governor Tim Walz from Minnesota, our neighbors to the east, just really uh, excited to have some Midwest spirit. Uh, uh, roll up our sleeves and get the job done. So uh, with Harris at the top of the ticket, uh, we couldn't ask for a, a better ticket. The theme for the first day of the convention is for the people. Speakers are expected to pay tribute to President Joe Biden, who will also give a speech tonight. Less than a month ago, Biden dropped out of the presidential race and passed the torch to Harris. I think it was a very courageous decision that um, that he made. It's a very tough decision. I, you know, ambition is going to drive you and put, to put all that aside and to say, I want to save this country and make sure that we have a better, you know, future. Uh, in, in the future is, is, is very courageous. I am so grateful for the work that he has done and specifically in South Dakota, his infrastructure investment into our state is changing all four corners of our state with water projects, with roads and bridges, with support all through the pandemic. The, the Biden administration will go down in history as one of the administrations that's been the most supportive to rural communities. Lauren Solick, Kelloland News. The Democratic Party releases platform ahead of the convention and includes support for raising the federal minimum wage to $15 per hour, making the child tax credit permanent, and creating protections for IVF and abortion services.